Well, hello again, uh, Mike here. <clears throat> I want to do a follow-up video on these uh, bagpipes that I got from Bagpipes Galore. These are the uh, Delrin, the plain Delrin bagpipes. Um, I'm going to try and keep this as short as possible so I don't lose your attention. Uh, but just very quickly, uh, <clears throat> kind of no frills. There's no ornamentation, no flashiness, all that. Um, these are plain black uh, Delrin plastic. Probably pretty durable. I, I don't imagine that they're as susceptible to moisture and and all and cracking and all that stuff. Um, there's the the uh, cord. It's a nice white uh, heavy cord there. That's that's nice. Um, the bag is like a uh, uh, what a uh, corduroy um, type bag, and then it's obviously got the the matching color. Um, uh, I don't know whatever stitching or or uh, whatever. Um, this bag I uh, opted to spend the extra um, well 15 pounds uh, you can do the conversion um, I'm in the Midwestern United States so it was American dollars for me but I got the zippered bag because um, if you drop a drone reed or or if you want to put a uh, moisture control system in that is an absolute necessity well worth the money and then this is a it's a uh, synthetic bag so you don't need uh, doesn't require seasoning or anything like that the um, blow stick here is also the Delrin plastic, um, and then the chanter is Delrin plastic as well. So everything matches up nicely. Um, like I say, I've had these things for about two months now, and I gotta say that there is very, very little, um, if anything bad, I can say about it. I mean, man, you know, they're they're not flashy, they're not like eye catching or anything, but. They sound good, they play good, and they're very affordable. If you're looking for something um, entry level, or I mean, it doesn't even have to be entry level. If you're not going to be playing in a in a pipe band that requires really uh, flashy pipes, I mean, this might be for you. <clears throat> um, I was looking for something uh, uh, affordable and playable. I looked uh, around, you know, online and everything, and looked at the Pakistan pipes and everything. I decided to go with uh, these. Um, made in Scotland, I figure, you know what, it's uh, it's the real deal, made in Scotland, so um, I, I am absolutely, I'm in love with these things, really, um, Can't I can't say enough good about them, so hey, what I'm going to do is, um, I'm going to go ahead and cut the video, um, do a little rearranging here, and I'm going to play a little bit for you now, um, I've been playing for about two months, and it's been self-taught, so uh, don't expect a whole lot. There's going to be some squeaks and, and missed notes and things like that. I am not showing off my playing ability. What I'm doing is I'm showing you what these things sound like. So um, if you can accept that, stand by and I'll be right back. All right, so here we are. Uh, like I said, don't judge too badly about uh, my playing ability. I'm, I'm going to play uh, just like a phrase or two of going home just so you can see what it sounds like so uh here we go <laughs> sound too bad so um, I would highly recommend these things uh, if you're looking for a good affordable good sounding set of bagpipes here you go you can't go wrong good luck <laughs> 